to install netbeans in your linux system you need to check out the link given in the description and uh, using that link you can download this file so this is the cell file for netbeans so what you need to do you can simply right click and open the terminal or you can cd to the folder where you have downloaded the file so the file is in this directory the home directory this is a regular file so we need to make it an executable file and for that you have to type chmod then plus x and uh, file name that is apache so we are basically saying that uh, hey make this file executable so if i hit enter and if i hit ls again then you can see the color is changed to green that means it can be executed now so now i can simply type dot slash and the file name that is a p a c h then hit the tab key to auto complete the file name hit enter and it will start the installation so here is the installer so this is saying you can customize the installer but i don't want to so i can simply click next and here is the agreement that you have to accept and uh, you are not able to read the text written here because of the theme that i have enabled in my system that is why you are not able to see it next and this is saying the application will be installed in this directory and uh, jdk okay so it has recognized the zdk that is installed in my system so i can specify the path for the zdk if i want so i'm going with the default settings click next it is saying check for the internet connection and the total installation size click next and this has started to install the application in the home directory so just wait for the installation to be finished So installation completed successfully and it has also updated three updates in the IDE. So I can hit the finish button here and now I can simply search for NetBeans in the system. So there is Apache NetBeans 11.2. This is the NetBeans. It's starting up and now you can start your project if you want. Go to files, new project and choose from the projects that you want to start and start coding. So that's all in this video. I hope this helped you and if you like the video then don't forget to subscribe to the channel and i'll catch you in the next one till then take care and keep enjoying linux